Hello, and welcome back to some more Guacamelee 2. In the last episode, which was episode 14, I know this because I've put all the episodes together so far. This is once again a new play session. Um, we defeated Z Zope? Zote? The Mighty Zote? No, that's Hollow Knight. Um, the, 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 the Vulture. I think he was a vulture? I don't actually know what it was. Um, and Cactuado. I remember what Cactuado's name was. Zope. Was it Zope? I don't know. Um, it was probably a pun of some variety. Anyway, um, we're making our way up to these, the various layers of the Inferno. Uh, and we're heading up to this, I'm assuming, or maybe that's there. Ah, I don't know. Either way, we're going up. Uh, so let's hope. Of course, this being a different day, anything I may have learnt from my previous play sessions will have undoubtedly been forgotten. Oh, hello. Oh, it's you again. I guess the shaft doesn't go- oh man. <laughs> we went all the way down and around there only to come up uh, just beneath them. Well buddy, you win some you lose some I guess, you can come through here now if you want. Prepare to be blown away by the fruits of our labour, a true mechanical marvel. So yeah, ju just for, for reference, we went all the way down here across to there up through all of this i think didn't we do all of this um just to get there and come out literally oh dear um but that there's something i want to try Uh, that wasn't that, actually. That was not what I wanted to try. Uh, I want to get... How do I get up there? Can I get up there? Right, there was this... Which I have to remember not to double jump for initially. And of course I need to remember what the buttons are. That barrel is floating. Now. I seem to recall we couldn't do this. Because we hadn't got the floaty thing. Uh, the floaty thing, the, the chargey upwards thing. No, oh, that's the wrong button. You moron. <sighs> so. Yes! Okay. Mm. So, we can only use one ability per each one. Balls. Uh, so... I 
just need to get over one more. Yeah. Woohoo! Woo I'm I am glad it gives you a little save point in, in many of these rooms. Okay, but that was not actually what I wanted to do, so I'm guessing that passage there must just be the fall into hell. Yeah, because th there doesn't seem to be any any way of getting up there. Right. In that case, let us venture forth. They've got conveyor belts. Uh. Huh. That wasn't the button I meant to press. Interesting. It's water in both worlds. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, is this the way? Yes, this is the way. To the chicken temple. Open up. These things. Fortunately, I have upgraded uh, the hollow everything. Uh, interesting. Can't get through there. The fight. Like, super duper. Uh, oh, that's not. The... Oh, jeez. Take that, you card. <laughs> well, nope. Hey, I do like that little uh, cry of excitement. Another egg power. Congratulations, now you can press B to lay an egg. Huevo! What? No, the egg doesn't explode. No, you certainly can't throw it. What's it for? What kind of questions are these? It's an egg. It's the miracle of birth. Oh, if the miracle of birth isn't enough to impress you, you can just go. The exit is behind me.
Uh. What? What? No, oh, screw you. I, I, hmm. I don't understand. There has to be a use for them. I would have thought. Maybe there's not. Maybe there. Oh, here we go. Uh... I do like the uh, the bouncing around puzzles that it makes us do. These are not fertilized achievements unlocked. Uh, what is the? I don't understand. Heading to the Temple of the Snake, chosen one. You must first go to Illa Bonita. It's just past this excessively lengthy body of water. So I'm assuming... Yes, we can get to like that. Okay, uh... Oh, this looks... Yes, this is another... This is a new area entirely. The areas in this game are impressive in their size. The solar! It's so pretty here! Look at the waterfall! If the world wasn't ending, this would be a great vacation spot. I think the snake temple might be just past that church. Let's go up there. Let's get up there. Apparently the Salvador fella was a serious threat. How much damage could a single man possibly do? Oh, flame face. He's still saying the same stuff. And you're fog. Uh, oh, can't get through that way. This is a very vertical zone. Hello, Lucador. Looking for a safe place to rest? Please visit the chapel here and let the Mother Superior tell you a tale. This here is the chapel where Salvador grew up. I hope I get to see him again soon. He's so handsome. Lucador, are you going after Salvador? Please be careful. He has become exceedingly powerful. You can hear it in the rattle of his cough. Sorry, but the Temple of the Snake is strictly off limits to the public. It's crazy dangerous in there. Unmaintained stairwells, deadly hover snakes. Deadly hover snakes. If you seriously need to get in, you better talk to the Mother Superior in the chapel. She asked me to keep watch here. I say roughly the same thing. I love this town so much, I couldn't imagine living forever anywhere else. 
I feel so at home here. The majestic waterfalls, the cosy small town feel. Ah, this is the good life. Buenas tardes, Lucador. That mask you are wearing, it is truly special. We once had a mask like that here. Come closer. Yeah. You've come to learn about Salvador. I remember. He was just a sweet baby left at my doorstep. Flashback time! I made a promise that day. This island became home for Chava. Chava? He was always a determined child. The waterfall was his favourite spot. He wanted to become a strong Lucador. And he did become strong. His technique was outstanding. But I didn't think he was ready. His spirit wasn't strong enough for the burden of the mask. His despair still weighs heavily on me. Perhaps I could have found a way. Perhaps I could have saved him. But I failed. And darkness would eventually own him. The promise I made that day, I still haven't broken it, that I would love him dearly every day of his life. Anyway, here's Wonderwall. Salvador's ceremonies in the Temple of the Snake, I can't will allow you through, it's to the left. The mask is consuming him, Lucador. Do what you must. Oops. Whee! Okay. Oh, hello. Doc Times, Manor! But check it. I spent a lot more time reading about the timeline rifts in El Otramundo. There are actually an infinite number of timelines in existence. Can you imagine an infinite number of me's? It's wild. Inside El Otramundo, you can access any timeline, but I bet it's a crazy maze in there. Technically, though, El Otramundo ties all the timelines together. So, I bet we're going to have to go to El Otramundo. Just before we head to the Temple of the Stake. Whoa. Just want to see if the people around here have got the Chava was so beloved by the people in this town. We had something something. Oh hello. Thanks! See this is this is why you explore in Metroidvanias. Salvador is the coolest. He's so dark and edgy. Bet you his parents don't understand, but he totally doesn't care. Hey, Lucador. Nice evening for a wrestle, isn't it? Uh, yes. 
Yes, it is. Bring the meteor to the skeleton. Bring the meteor to the skeleton. So that wasn't meant for you. I think I'm lost. What? I... Spanish words. Please, Daniela, we can't keep doing this. That must be a reference to something. I bet you're asking yourself, how does he play trumpet if he has no lips? Well, look at all to that, I say. Mind your own business. Hello. Hi there, my name is Inatawi Urot. I lost a lot of my coins down in a maze and I'm not really fit enough to get them back. If you can go and successfully retrieve them, they'll be yours. What do you say? You'll have two minutes to collect the coins before you die for no apparent reason. Good luck. Oh, what the? Not actually saving myself any time by trying to do that. There's probably an optimum route for this. But I'll be damned if I know what it is. So I shall just keep on going. Point for seconds. Going alright so far. And. Yeah! Ooh! And that's another... chunk of life. Congratulations on collecting all the coins. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks. Ow. Maestro de Tacos! This cliff side is the best place to relax. Ah, so perfectly tucked away from everyone else. They suspect nothing. <laughs> Hello, chicken. The chosen one. Behind me lies a portal which we believe contains one of the special key pieces. However, the prophecy says that the one worthy of the key will be capable of laying eggs. So, chosen one, you must demonstrate this for me before I can let you through. It's true. Not only are you the chosen one, you can even lay eggs. Please go on ahead through the portal and find the key piece we believe is inside. Special delivery. Thanks very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, hit the thumbs up and consider subscribing. Remember to ring the bell to be notified when new videos go live. And until next time, toodle pip. <laughs>